Hey everyone, welcome to May's Log Life. I'm May, and this is my first impression video of the Tandem Collar Pajama Set. I am so excited to see this because I already am just looking at the little color swatches there, and I'm so excited about the colors. I cannot wait to see this. Okay, so right off, let's just look at the colors because that's what excited me the most right now. Um, actually, before I go on, holy cow, $99. That's $100 for this. Ah, <sighs> these better be made of something like silk or something, but that is really expensive for a pajama set. Uh, okay, so let's quickly look. So this is Pine Ornaments Teal. Uh, that is cute. So if you're really into that, that in that print, you must be thrilled that there's a pair of pajamas that you can now have, that you can wake up on Christmas morning and have that set and maybe carry all of your other items that are in uh, Ornaments Pine. <laughs> so... Yeah, that's cute. Look at the cuffs. The cuffs have a whole other solid color, like a complimentary color. That's cute. And oh, is that a stripe? Oh, yeah, there's a stripe on the side. And they've chosen blue. You know what? Good, co good color choice because you don't see the blue as well. You can really see the pinks and the purples, but you can't see the blue as well. So to have the blue and the on the bands and on that stripe really pulls out the blue. So now you can really see the blue better. So that's actually a really good choice of color. Um, and it actually is something I would not completely not consider wearing. This is not something I ever thought I would get as a bag, but if I got these for Christmas, I would not be sad. I don't think I'll get them for myself because it's not really a color I look good in generally, but I would not be in the, in the least bit upset if I got this set for Christmas and I would definitely wear them. So pockets. Oh, there's also a pocket right here at the front. Helpful. Very helpful on that breast pocket. Oh, look, and even the inside is the same color as the cuffs. That's cute. That is very, very cute. Okay, looks like it fits quite well. Oh my gosh, Buffalo Check Red. Now, there's a lot of Buffalo Check Red out there, but I gotta tell you, that one's pretty cool. I do like that a lot. Uh, it's helpful that I get to know that, you know, this is what the models are wearing, what size they're wearing. Uh, you know, the, I can finally see an XL model wearing an XL item. That's so perfect. So, and it still looks good. See, I would have never, ever put a plaid on someone who's not like a size three, size, size three, size two, size four, uh, maybe size six, because, uh, as when I was younger and I was like thin, I could wear pretty much anything. But and then as I get, as I got fluffier, um, those kinds of patterns looked worse and worse and worse on me. Uh, and so now I avoid all these kinds of Pre, uh, prints completely but I miss them but you know what she looks oops sorry about the camera bang there um she looks fantastic in that is an, an extra large and it looks so good on her it hangs really really well like it's not it's not it's too tight anywhere so I might get it so maybe it's just the way things are cut and the way things are built uh and that's what makes things look better versus not so I if she's wearing an XL I might actually try ordering maybe a pair of this if it looks like something I would get because that is such a cute color. I love that so much. Uh, okay, so that's the size chart. Oh, hang on. Did we see that? I didn't see that. I don't, oh, I guess we haven't looked at the colors yet, have we? No, I guess we have not looked at the colors. Okay, so uh, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I was just looking at the teal uh, and I went too far. Okay, that's what happened. Okay, let's go back, let's go back, let's go back. I was just looking at the teal, at the uh, ornaments teal. Okay, sorry, 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 I jumped ahead. Um, butterfly gray, very popular. So I'm just gonna click through these fast. Oh, and look, the cuffs and probably the stripe is purple. That mauvey color, let's just go fast because I kinda, oh, and the trim, even the piping uh, around the top is in that same pink and right around the pocket here. That's cute. I love the details. I love the little attention to detail there. It definitely looks like it's kind of fuzzy and, and peachy, fuzzy feeling, so. Okay, so Buffalo Check Red, which I guess we've already sort of seen, but let's look at it again. Oh my god, it's so cute. Love it. I, yeah, I have no problem getting this. I think that's a very, very cute set. Um, ooh, Camo Taupe. Uh, another fan favorite. Not my personal favorite, but hey, they've got, they put the same piping in there, so that's kind of fun. Okay, um, and then let's go to the next one, which I'm very excited to see. Come on, click. Go, go, go. Um, okay, I generally do like this print, and I think it looks not bad here, but I don't think I like it as much. I thought I would like it so much more. 
Um, I like it better as a bag. <laughs> For some reason, I find it's just a little too busy, maybe, on this particular garment. I don't know. Um, so I guess I won't be getting this one, even though it, I love the print generally. It's one of my absolute favorite prints that Lug makes. I mean, it's not terrible, but I don't love it for some reason. I don't know why I should. Is Everything about it says I should, but I just don't love it. Uh, okay, the next one here is what I'm really excited about. <sighs> that would be so fun to wake up on Christmas morning. That is so, so cute. I love it. So this is the Snowflake Navy. And look at the light blue cuffs and the light blue piping. Very, very sweet. And the color is quite bright, actually. It's a really good vibrant blue in this. The, the snowflake navy is really good and vibrant. Now, again, it could just be the way the lights are reflecting off of it. But um, I like it so far. Um, not everything looks good when it's blown up on a larger thing. Um, and sometimes when you change the fabrics, the color changes as well. Um, so this fabric obviously did really well at holding the colors up and not just sort of having them all muted. Um, that's cute. That's so cute. And it looks like it's a little bit like a little bit fuzzy so they might have a bit of a peach fuzz going on which I love in my pajamas and let's see oh sorority rose now um we saw I think it was R R river on the R R readers on the river event a while ago um and Amy and Debbie did an impromptu show I think at the like at the hotel they were at or whatever it was and they were wearing these when they did their little show so we did get a little sneak peek of this uh, it's not my favorite. I'm not a huge Serenity Rose, uh, Serenity Rose, Serenity Rose uh, print. Um, and uh, I'm still not really, yeah, I'm not hooked on it. It's a little too pink for me. And uh, I, I get chaos when I see that. <laughs> I don't feel Serenity at all when I see that print. I just see, yeah, an, a sleepless night with my thoughts just running through my brain. All right, Snowflake, that's uh, Snowflake, Snowman Trees is got the yellow piping and the yellow stripe. I'm not sure if I love it. I think it's a little too bumblebee. I think it would have been better off without the stripe. And I know that that's probably the only color they could have chosen. It makes no sense to have a black one. But you know what? I don't think I like it. It's not my, it's like, I do like this print and I do like it on this scale on this garment. But I think of that because of the, the, the big band of yellow, it's a lot of yellow for me. Um, so that's probably not going to be something I will be getting. Um, but otherwise, the pajamas are really, really comfortable, and I love that print. I think if they had maybe made something, like the piping would have been yellow, would have been good yellow, but I don't like the stripe down the side of the leg. I think that's too much. I'm fine with the cuffs being, like on the arms being yellow, but I feel like that stripe down the leg is just a little weird. Um, so it takes away from the, from the lushness of the print, I think. But anyways, that's just me. Um, and then lastly is the... Whimsy Black, which we just saw Amy in that earlier photo. Now, I'm not a massive fan of busy, busy, busy prints as a general rule. I like them on smaller items, so like I wouldn't mind an accessory in this particular print. Um, and the 1991 me would have been all over this print because I loved I loved these colors when I was that age, um, like especially like on a darker background. Um, and I think I would have liked it better instead of the mauve or the purple, like that sort of pink, that pur like purpley rosy color. Um, instead of that being the piping and, and, and the cuffs, I would have liked it if they had done that in teal or in that blue there. Um, that would have been my personal liking if I if they, they chosen the blue there um, because I'm more of a blue girl. But for those of you who are pink girls and purple girls, uh, I'm so happy for you because that's, that's cute. That is a very, very cute color uh, mix there. So... Anyway, oh, look at how cute, like even, the, I just love that the back is like the interior is also the same color as the, the accent color there. So, um, all right, so let's just see, we can look at some of those photos. There's Amy with the matching bag hanging out. Um, I just don't, this is interesting how they're not doing this in a studio anymore. They're doing these like at someone's house and I'm, I'm wondering if it's her house. Um, and if, yeah, if it is, her house is immaculate. I mean, obviously it has to be because they're doing a photo shoot, but still. Um, and, um, yeah, I don't think I would wear this out anywhere. So I don't know why that, I mean, I guess the bag is just there just for fun, but I wouldn't take my matching bag out with this for sure. <laughs> um, yeah, those are cute. Those look really, really good. And look at the blanket back here. Ah, see this pup. Whose pup is this? I need to know whose pup this is. I need to know the name of this dog. I need all the I need all the deets on this dog. It is so so cute. I'm 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 in love with this puppy. 
with the bangs and the eyebrows and the mustache. Oh my God, too, too cute. I want this dog. If I can order this dog, I would. <laughs> I would order this dog. I would buy this dog from, from whomever doesn't want it. Um, okay, so fun colors, really, really good array, really good and bright. You've got wintry things. You've got sort of uh, like very Christmas. So that's the Christmas line there. This is just sort of every day. You can go into spring. You can go into fall. I love this color lineup. It is probably the best color lineup they've got. Oh, look at the waist. So it's a good big wide waistband as well. And that's really, really nice. That looks really comfortable. So I think they've hit this right off uh, with the best color range so far in all of the um, clothing that they've come up with so far. The colors, like I said, there's really good stuff for the, for the winter and for Christmas, which is what this season is. So there's going to be a lot of people buying them just to be able to have like, you know, uh, Christmas pajamas, which is awesome. Um, but those Christmas pajamas, you can extend a little bit further because they don't like scream at Merry Christmas. It's not like Santa um, or, you know, don't open till the 25th, like those kinds of things. Um, it's so that you could wear it through the winter. You could wear any of those quote Christmas prints, except maybe the or ornaments teal because that's pretty bang on Christmas with the ornaments uh, but the other ones are just winter prints you can just wear them through the winter so you can get a lot more wear out of them and then you've got like the light pinks and the autumn with the with the leaves um, yeah excellent excellent color palette on this one um, or print palette if you want to call it uh, and it looks really quite comfortable. So um, have I read this yet? No, I haven't read the about. Okay, let's read the about. Sorry, sorry. I just got obsessed with the colors. Um, so best PJs ever. I really hope so. Uh, we dare you to find a more comfortable PJ combo than this. Made with super soft, high quality material, plus patterns made famous by our lugs. Oh, sorry, by our bags. Um, the cozy tandem uh, jersey notch. I don't know what jersey notch collar PJ set is. Uh, they didn't put the notch in the top thing. Jersey knot. I don't know what that is. Um, so I have to look that up because <laughs> I have no idea what that is. We will have you coming down, uh, sorry, counting down the hours until your nighttime routine comes. Uh, until, until, until your nighttime routine. Uh, I know I said comes. I think my, my I just jumped up to the word collar and I freaked out. <laughs> or you could just wear them all day. We won't judge. Okay, so if you wonder why I'm having trouble, I've got a headache. I'm reading out of one eyeball and my eye sort of jumps a little bit when I'm reading out of one eyeball. So I have trouble reading when I'm, I should open my second eye, but <laughs> when I have a headache, it, it seems to shut down a little bit and I tend to read out of the one eye. So maybe I shouldn't be reading out loud when I've got a headache. Uh, measurements, I got to assume is the same chart. And then, so let's see here. So the top uh, has a one chest pocket, which by the way, I think that should have always been a little bit bigger. I think they should always make the chest pocket a little bit bigger because those things you can put like what? I don't know. I don't know what you could put in there. Very little. Uh, lip balm, maybe. But it always sits in that weird part, like right on your boob. <laughs> And it just looks weird. So anyway, uh, printed a, what was I saying? Printed cozy uh, brush jersey, 95% polyester and 5% spandex. You know what would have been really nice? If they had put pockets on the top, like down, like lower. So you have like one, two pockets, like sort of like where the pocket, like where, like, like the, the, how do I put this? Like, you know where you're, like if you had a hoodie, it would be like that kangaroo pocket pouch. Instead of having it like a kangaroo pocket, just have like two side ones. That would have been really nice too, as opposed to the one on the breast, because then you could put more stuff into it and it doesn't get in the way of your, of your boob. Because <laughs> I've always thought breast pockets are, are stupid on women because yes, they kind of just add like a little, you know, fun little element if it's a plain shirt. But if it's something like that and it's supposed to be functional, then everything just sits kind of weird on your chest. So anyway, just saying. So I would have liked if they had put other pockets on the top. Um, and then also have pockets in the, in the pants, but that's just me being picky. Um, and then, so yeah, two slash pockets in the pants, uh, printed cozy brush Jersey, 95% polyester. Okay. So we looked at that already and then it's machine washable. So it's the exact same thing. Gentle cycle, tumble dry, low, remove promptly, iron on low. You have to. Okay. By the way, is anybody out there ironing their pajamas? Does anybody do that? I really want to know. I want to know if anyone is still ironing pajamas. I just feel like that is such a gone, like a bygone thing. Uh, and I have only known one person in my entire life who irons her pajamas. And yeah, she's odd, <laughs> to say the least. So um, yeah, so there we go. So I think we looked at all the colors. Oh, hang on. There's a video. Let's look at the video. All right, here we go. Yeah, they, I like the I like the how they hang. They hang really nicely. 
And I'm really glad that I'm, we're seeing models who don't have like, you know, like no bum. <laughs> because you always want to make sure that if you've got a bit of a caboose or you've got chest, you, you know, that, you know, it's going to fit and hang well on you. Um, I would have loved it if maybe we'd gotten a plus size model, but anyway. But those are, those are so cute. Oh my gosh, I want those so badly. I wonder if Lug's going to come up with a onesie. <laughs> Um, I would not wear one, but I know they're really, really popular. So, but, uh, and I feel like, you know, Lug would make a really cute onesie. So, um, yeah, no, I love the lineup. I think every color here is amazing. I love the design. I just don't love that stripe. It's just not me. I know they put it in there for an extra pop of color. I think it would have been better if it was like just a line of piping down the side. So the piping that you see along the collar and down the front of the shirt, if they had made that same line down the side or maybe two lines down the side, if you want to give it that much more color, I would have been happy with that. So if they put the piping on the side uh, as opposed to the big like policeman stripe, I think I would have been much happier with it. So that's me personally. If they had put like, like piping down there, I would have been mwah, perfect. But uh, anyway, so I think that's the one deterrent for me. But you don't really notice it on some of the garments more than like others. Like this one you can really see because it's that bright yellow. Uh, you don't really see it on the buffalo check red because, I mean, it's all stripes essentially, right? Um, <laughs> you really don't notice it on that one. So I'd probably get it on that. Um, but uh, yeah, no. I, I love the colors. I love the lineup. I love the design. I'm really hoping that fabric is really, really nice. It sounds like it's going to be great. Um, and I think I, I trust that Lug has pretty nice fabrics on all of their garments. I mean, I've, I have now touched a couple of, so I think I have a shirt uh, and I've touched a, uh, like, they had that, like that sort of sweatshirt hoodie thing going on um, a long time ago, maybe a couple years ago now, three years ago. Um, and it's so soft and it's, and it's, and it's just really, really nice on your skin. So, um, if they were able to make that for like the, the things they put in their mystery box, I have to assume that when they went way out of their way to really design a true lug worthy clothing line, I think it's going to be amazing. So like those are the ones that kind of threw in as like a bonus in the mystery boxes and they were still awesome. So they have a really high standard, I think, of what they know is what's soft and comfortable. So I'm very positive that the, none of these things are going to be uncomfortable. I just kind of want to know how warm they are. For, I think for me, just because I would, uh, I would roast if they were too hot. So anyways, there we go. That is my first impression video for the Tandem Collar Pajama Set. Tell me what you think. Tell me if you've got some. If you do have them, please tell me what you think of them. Uh, and tell me what you think of the colors as well. Are they as vibrant as they look here? Or are they a little bit more muted? Do they look a bit more brushed once you see them? Um, and if you've washed them, how well do they stand up to the washing? Um, that I want to know as well. It's like there are some things that you buy, they look great for the first two or three times you wear them and all of a sudden they just start to fade. Um, and I, I really want to know how these hold up in the, in the wash as well. So, uh, so yeah, if you have them, talk to me, let us know what you think. Um, and, uh, yeah. And tell me if you're getting more as well. Like, are you going to go back and get more? Uh, is this, a, was this a hit enough that you're like, yes, I'm now just waiting for new colors. Um, and these are now my go-to pajamas. I'm pitching all the rest. I definitely would love to know that. So that is it. Thank you so much for watching. Take care and I'll see you next time.